Hi guys, remember the Hunger Games of Ballads of Songbirds and Snakes. For I do add a life is going from Cage Morris album. So it's a dystopian action film. Uh it's ba it's based on the twenty twenty novel The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes by Suzanne Collins. So this is a prequel to the Hunger Games from twenty twelve and it's the fifth installment of the Hunger Games film series. It stars Tom Blythe, Rachel Zegler, Peter Dinklage, Hunter Schaffer, Josh Andres River Rivera and Viola Davis. Set sixty four years before the end the first one. It's both Follows the events that eventually lead a young Cora Lena Snow on the path to becoming the tyrannical leader of Panna, including his relationship with the Hunger Games tribute, Lucy Gray Baird, during the year of the 10th Hunger Games. Now, this was a prequel, and I remember when they announced this, a lot of people weren't looking forward to it. It's like, why are they making a prequel? And then I saw the trailers, I thought they're great, and I love the Hunger Games, and I love the four. Um, I do think Mocking J. Palmer is the weakest. One, but I love Catch and Fire, the best one in the series. I love the original one, like Mocking J Part 2. So I was looking forward to this, and I thought it was great. I thought the cast was good, the chemistry, um, specifically Tom Blythe and Rachel Zegler was good. Violet Davis was good in this, I love Hunter Schaffer. P. Dinkage was good, and I thought the story was okay. Um, and I've not read the book, so I don't know how accurate it is. And I thought it was okay. Um, it was good. I do think it was a bit. I feel. I do feel like it was on a bit too long. I think it's like two hours, I think forty something minutes. But yeah, the action is good. The visuals are great. I think the music. Uh, Francis Lawrence comes back. Um, he directed um all the fantastic, all the um Hunger Games except the first one. That one was directed by Gary Ross. Um, the music by James Dean Howard. I think he did the previous movies. And if you like Hunger Games, I recommend you check this one. I think it's okay. And. Uh, so I give it a 7 out of 10. When I watch it again, maybe. I thought it was okay. Um, I'm not a huge fan of prequels. I think this is probably one of the good ones. Um, Pearl was good. Prey was good. And I'm not a huge fan of prequels, to be honest. I think usually they're not all that great. But I thought this was fine. It did what it needed to. And, yeah, you can you can just watch this and then go straight to Hunger Games 2000, 2012. And then just watch the others. But, yeah. And, yeah, I thought it was great. Um... I thought the cast was great. I thought the chemistry between Rachel Zegler and Tom Blythe was great. Um, you like action movies, you might like this. Um, I give it a 7 out of 10. I was from the cinemas today. And I enjoyed it. It really surprised me. Um, I didn't expect it to like it that much. And um, yeah, it was a solid entry in the Hunger Games franchise. I don't know what happens after this. Um, and Suzanne Collins um, writes another book. I don't know if we're going to get another Hunger Games movie. I, I, I don't know what you really do with it at this point. But... Um, I thought it was great, um, it was emotional, I thought it was great, and I enjoyed it, I thought it was great, and, um, I do think it's a bit too long at times, but, I, but, yeah, so, guys, so much for my video, I see, I give it a 7 out of 10, guys, so much for my video, see my next one, bye.